And there it is, the full-time whistle. You've got to say, not much to choose between the two teams on the back of this first leg, Lee. Well, the players have done their bit, both sets of players earning the draw. Now it's up to the coaches. They'll be going back to the drawing board, trying to work out where the weaknesses are of the opposition in for a cracker in that second one. In the final analysis, he was one of their better players, but needed to be better still, I think. Well, sometimes you lose that fight against your individual opponent. That was the case today for him. Just totally outclassed, didn't really get into the game. Needs to do better next time out. Well, I can tell you from past experience, this city is well worth a visit. We're in Seville at the Ramon sanchez Pizjuan Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And it's a quarter-final second leg battle in the UEFA Champions League. It's Sevilla against Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, thanks, Derek. We're in for a real cracker. So delicately poised at nil-nil. We always used to say nil-nil's never a bad result at home. No away goals against. Now the away team, can they push for that vital away goal? Sevilla starting 11. Getting the nod in goal is Tomas Watzlik. Diego Carlos plays alongside Sergi Gomez in central defence. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Here's the starting 11 for Borussia Dortmund. chance here just cleared away in the nick of time advantage Borussia Dortmund can they convert and a goal as they take another step in the right direction on the path to progress Well, as we can see, the keeper's done his best, but there's nothing he can do from there. He's not going to miss that one. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? And over comes the corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Good defending to prevent the chance. And players waiting at the far post. And in it goes, and now they're firmly in control. Well, as we see again, that's how to score goals. Get the ball into the box from wide areas. And it's good, solid technique to get his header on target. But it's only because of the lack of challenge from the defenders. Really poor, that is, I have to say. Aslak, Azar, and there it is, another goal, and surely there's no way back from this now. Well, here we see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then the sheer power of the strike. Really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. And there it is.
it is, the final whistle, victory over the two legs for Borussia Dortmund. Well, Derek, what confidence that will give him. A huge margin to go through into the next round. Played very, very well. That confidence, you can use that. You have to. It's like gold dust. Go into the next round with that confidence. Who knows where they can go? Well, certain things came off for him in this game, but not everything, Lee. Well, he did OK, I suppose. He'll be down because of the result. There's no doubt about that. But he'll look at his own game and ask whether he did enough. Not sure he did.